Honestly, Joby is of the past. I don't need that thing. Don't need it. But just who is Brock? Brock. Where did he come from? It is a strange story that begins many years ago. All right, let's get this going. So that little sequence I shot there uh, was actually all shot with this Ulanzi tripod. And that's what this whole video is gonna be about. So let's get into all of that, uh, why I like it, why you'll like it, and maybe why you should purchase it. No problem. Okay, so before I was using this uh, Gorilla Pod by Joby, but uh, as you know, these things can fall down quite a bit. Um, they're not really sturdy, especially after a while. The, uh, you know, these things kind of get a little bit loose like this, just fall in everywhere. Um, if you've used one before and you've had one for quite a while, they do uh, wear over time. And don't get me wrong, I do really like this thing. Um, I've used it for the past almost a year. Um, really did like it. Got me through a lot of videos that I've made, a lot of vlogs. Um, yeah, don't hate the thing. But I've always been on the search for something better that works a lot better. And uh, I think that's where the Ulanzi uh, tripod comes into play. Okay, so I uh, went on a trip to Mexico and the weather here has been crazy bad. That's why I sound like shit right now. But I used this Ulanzi the whole time I was there and I, uh, I really love this thing. So the things that I was looking for in it is that it stands up well, it's high enough. You don't have to worry about it falling over. Very easy to use and well made, but also not like $200. <laughs> You know, I've seen those uh, ones that Peter McKinnon made videos about. Those look really dope. I'd love that, but it's over $200 Canadian. And I'm not spending that much for just a vlogging tripod. And trust me, this thing's a beast when it comes to all of those things that I just mentioned. It does have a ball head mount that actually can go downwards, upwards, especially downwards when you are vlogging, you could hold the handle point it downwards at you it gives it um, a little bit better of an angle and put it upwards when you're doing like a talking head whenever you're kind of uh going out vlogging you want to put your camera down kind of talk to the camera okay okay this part is huge for me my favorite thing about it is the quick release it has one of these on it and what this does is um i actually have a backpack mount that just fits in my backpack so i can actually throw my camera on my backpack throw the tripod in the side pocket in my camera bag and I'm pretty well hands-free. It also does adjust higher and lower by the turn of these small legs, which is super simple, super fast to do, makes it taller, longer, gotta love it. Um, it also does have a swivel mount on the side to turn it around left or right. It also is built carbon fiber. Um, it's very small, the build quality is great. Also a shoe mount on the side built in, which you could hook up a mic, a light, pretty well anything you wanna hook up onto this thing, you have that extra shoe mount. Technically, you pretty well have two different shoe mounts, one on top of the camera, one on the right here. So you have a light on top, mic on the side, you're sailing. And honestly, I used this the whole time I was in Mexico and I didn't find any problems other than the fact that this thing did get loose after my whole trip, but I was there for two weeks. If you could hear that, it's um, kind of loose right here. Um, it's just loose there, but uh, you can tighten that. It, it does come with uh, three different Allen keys, but the shitty thing about it is none of those Allen keys fit this. So that's the one problem that I did have. Those Allen keys do not fit these uh, little screws in the bottom here. Those are the things that are actually loose. So that's a bummer. So I have to go out and buy an Allen key that fits this, but it's still working right now. There's nothing like it's not going to fall apart, but it is a bit loose. Um, but other than that, this thing will be in my camera bag for honestly forever. I'll be using this to vlog every time I can. Um, honestly, Joby is of the past. I don't need that thing don't need it yeah this uh this really does fix all of my problems i really do love the fact you could point point it down 
and extend the legs and you have your camera pretty well facing the exact way at you that you want it and it's a little bit higher uh, which is great if you do have a heavy camera it is um, a little bit harder to hold but uh, come on bulk up man eat your green veggies take your protein bulk up no but for real my camera is actually quite heavy I have um, a 15 to 35 millimeter on uh, the Canon R6 and it's quite hefty so yeah vlogging with it is not that easy so I did switch to this a lot of the time when I was out um, it's the 24 to 105 um, f.4 I believe but uh, anyways I wanted this to be a quick video I'm kind of sick still and yeah let's call it let's call it here um, I've got a bunch of uh, those Cabo vlogs probably out coming out I'm not too sure I've just been trying to make videos while I can when I got the time things have been crazy but uh, yeah hopefully you guys subscribe like all that fun stuff okay peace out